Hi, Nicole Ayoub here, reporting for the Eye of the Storm. Today we are going to be interacting with the St. Luke's volleyball team, as well as presenting to you a new member of the St. Luke's athletic community, Coach Garrett Minyard. Let's go talk to Ms. Abbott. Hi, Coach Abbott. How are you today? I'm great. How are you? I'm awesome, thank you. So, what do you feel are some vital aspects that contribute to being a great coach? I think you have to be positive and you have to look for ways for your team to improve by offering specific feedback uh, based on what you're seeing. I also think a terrific coach also helps students and athletes figure those things out for themselves. At the beginning of the season, we did this really cool activity where we videotaped our athletes passing. Oh yeah, I remember. <laughs> and then we showed you the tape. So you were actually able to see, instead of us, us just telling you um, what was going on with your passing and how we can make your passing more accurate. Perfect. Um, so the next question is, what are some things that you love about teaching at St. Luke's and what are some things that make you want to come back each year? Uh, well, I love teaching and coaching at St. Luke's. Um, definitely the students. We're a really kind community. Um, we also have a really good sense of humor here, so I think the ability to laugh um, is really important too, and the way that we laugh together as a team keeps me coming back. And then just to see the improvement of the program over time since I first started here and to see the expansion of the, the team and also the growth of the team, not just on the court, but in terms of really building a community that's based on teamwork and sisterhood, that's really cool. Great. What effect do you think Garrett has on the team, both on the court and in the overall environment? We are so lucky to have Coach Garrett here. Um, he helped run our gold medal squared camp before the preseason started. So we asked him if he wanted to come on board as a regular member of the staff, and he said yes, and we were delighted. He's played at the collegiate level, he's played at the professional level, and he's coached at the professional level. So the technical skills he brings to the program have been unmatched. In fact, I would say out of anyone that's ever stepped foot on the St. Luke's court, Garrett has the most technical knowledge and the, the best command of the sport that I've ever seen. So that translates into the team environment, that translates into technical skills, and he's really been an invaluable member of the program this year. And on top of that, he's a really nice guy. Yeah, without a doubt. Thank you so much. Absolutely. <laughs> I'm now joined by Coach Garrett Minyard. How are you today? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm great, thank you. So give us some background context. How did you get into volleyball as a long-term career? Good question. Um, I started coaching when I was really young, actually when I was in high school. Uh, and I knew right away that it was something I wanted to get into. So when I graduated college, I started working at Chelsea Pierce in Stanford, and I continued to try to find myself a long-term opportunity there. Uh, I was finally granted one as the director of volleyball, and that's kind of where my long-term volleyball coaching career took off. Awesome, and what else do you do outside of coaching St. Louis? Um, I, in the summertime, I work with Gold Medal Square, and I travel around the country coaching high school volleyball teams of uh, all different levels. and. I actually, my wife and I just started our own volleyball club in Wilton, Connecticut, called Northeast Volleyball Club, and that runs year-round. We do clinics and travel teams, and again, pursuing that lifelong coaching dream. Wow, congratulations, and speaking of coaching, what is your coaching philosophy? My coaching philosophy is pretty simple. It's get everybody a lot better, um, try to show athletes that what you learn on the volleyball court can actually translate to the rest of your life. So everything that we do here, as you guys probably know, um, is more than just about volleyball. We talk a lot. Um, we're hopefully not just producing good volleyball players, but uh, great people in, in the long term. Yeah, without a doubt. Um, and what is your favorite thing about working with St. Luke's? I think my favorite thing about working with this group is all the great people that I've met here. Um, all of you guys are fantastic students and, and athletes and it's a pleasure to get to know you all and I'm sure somewhere down the line uh, we will meet again whether it's me coaching your kids someday or or something like that so I'm happy to make all these great connections. Wow thank you so much.
Thank you so much for tuning in to episode four of the Eye of the Storm and see you next time. Go Storm! Thank you.